today for the Bitcoin and altcoin prices. And yes, this is an actual emergency for all Bitcoin and altcoin holders, guys. Right now, there is some holding in the charts, which I was actually talking about earlier. Look at this here. I was mentioning that this is a diamond pattern with a much higher likelihood to break out towards the upside with our price target actually at 48,700. Right now, you can see that my scenario is so far perfectly planning out, uh, panning out. And the question, of course, is are we going to reach the price target or are there some specific levels we have to pay very close attention to? More importantly, also for all crypto holders, Let's just take the example here of Elrond, eGold. I was actually mentioning this breakout to be upcoming here on the symmetrical triangle on the hourly candles. As you can see, we broke out, we confirmed the breakout and we are right now going higher exactly as I was predicting it earlier. And just quickly guys, just that you know, if you are subscribed to the MM Crypto channel, you know that our Twitter channel got Delete it. I am working with all forces to get it back. But until then, I want to recommend you highly, highly to go down below. Let me quickly see where it is. To go down below uh, here in our Telegram group, you can see in our channel, we already have almost 14,000 people. I am sending you my trading updates, my price predictions, including price targets, trades and everything else in this Telegram group down below. It's, it, is, it is a channel. If you go to the pinned comment, the very first thing, click it right now and join the MM Crypto family. It is for free. It will always be for free. I am here for you. No matter whether, whether they are going to delete any other channel, I will always be for, uh, here for you. And now let's go over here into the price and let's discuss what is going to happen to Bitcoin in the immediate short term, what is going to happen to uh, Elrond in the immediate short term and also what is going to happen to the altcoins. And before I'm going over into it, I wanted to ask you guys to smash up the like button to a new all-time high. We are recently, every single time, completely crushing it. And it is because you are profitable, you are lovely, you are enlightened. Thank you so much for all your love. Thank you so much for all your support on the YouTube algorithm. It is not going unnoticed and the YouTube algorithm is truly noticing it here right now. So, as you remember, I was earlier predicting actually that in phase C we are going to see a low as you can see, phase C, and from there, actually zigzag accumulate if we are following the pattern towards the upside. This is exactly what's happening right now. And number one, look at this. What we need right now is actually the price to break above the previous rejection point. This previous rejection point being located exactly at 46,800 US dollars. And ladies and gentlemen, if I'm zooming out, you can see where this resistance is coming from, from all of these rejection points. So Bitcoin has to break above this specific level. We are right now hovering around there. But you can also see if I am going over here to the diamond pattern chart, which I predicted earlier to be likely to break out towards the upside. As you can see here, we broke out towards the upside. But in the end of the day, we always need a break above the previous rejection point, which would be in this case, guess what, 46,800. The moment we are breaking above that, I find it highly, highly likely for the Bitcoin price to actually reach my price target at 48,700 to 48,800 US dollars. And now people are asking me, of course, guys, if we are getting rejected, maybe put some stop losses if you are in a highly leveraged trade, please be careful. But people are asking me, what about the altcoins? Well, <coughs> I cannot talk about the whole altcoin section because for this we have to go on the total market cap. We have to close, if I'm going over to the weekly, above the previous one. So far we are still not breaking above. We need to break the 2.4 trillion US dollar level on the total crypto market cap, Bitcoin, including altcoins. What I can tell you though is especially for one of my favorite altcoins right now where I put in 2 million US dollars of my own money. It's not a trade. 2 million US dollars of my own money I put in this spot position. This is right now breaking out as I was predicting it, not only in the previous video, no, as I was predicting it here in my Telegram channel where you find the link down below. You can see it right here. I put my money where my mouth is and I am keeping you updated no matter, no matter what's going on. And here you can see we broke out and we are confirming the breakout. Right now we just need some follow through. If you are in this profitable trade, congratulations. Take some chips from the table already. If you are in a trade, I'm just holding for the longer term. I am looking out for much higher price targets. I will tell you those price targets. But you can see here the next profit taking area is right there at 320 US dollars. If I am quickly going out here, onto the four hourly candles, uh, zooming out a little bit more. Then you can see, just a second guys, actually let's, let's, 
zoom out right there. You know what? I have to go to the daily candles because I want to show you the longer term price target. So what we are doing here is to go over to the Fibonacci retracement. And if I'm tending, uh, putting this from the bottom all the way to the top, then you can see uh, Elrond is right now going very, very close to the 1.618, the 364 US dollar price level. The first target on this midterm run I am actually predicting for for quite some time here. People are asking me, Chris, how were you able to predict this bull run for Elrond when it was $730? I told you, I am expecting these higher price targets. People are asking me how. I am comparing it to the peer group. And if you are looking at Cardano, which is 70 times higher value, if you are looking at um, Solana, which is 10 times higher value, but Elrond being almost the same quality, if not the same or in some regards even better, then I can see in relative terms some undervaluation going on and this is why I put such a significant portion here, 2 million US dollars of my own equity in Elrond. Of course I am still holding Compound, I am still holding Cardano, I am still holding all of these other ones, but right now I am focusing on Elrond and this is the reason why. I can be wrong on that, don't point towards the finger with, uh, with the finger towards me if I'm wrong here. Do your own research, invest at your own risk. Thank you so much for watching, thank you so much for smashing up the like button to a new all-time high. We are going to see each other at the next one of MM Crypto and as always, guys, as always. I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye-bye. <laughs>